When you think of the holidays, you think about toys for the kids. But there's something else parents need to add to that wish list batteries, and a lot of them. With all the choices out there, consumer advocate Jen Strathman did the comparison shopping for you. Well, so many toys now have automatic on off switches on the bottom, but parents say the batteries are still dying. So, for three weeks, we tested all these batteries. We tried them in flashlights and in toy monkeys to find the one that lasts the longest in our test. Kids' toys will wear out any parent. Thank you. They spin, shake, and sing. For baby and me. All that noise gives dads like News Channel 5 employee Cliff Banks a headache. But he says changing the batteries is actually more frustrating. Even the doorbell on the little house has batteries in it. <laughs> and they, that's not easy to change. Cliff says he was prepared for diapers to break his budget, but not batteries. C batteries, D batteries, mostly in big boxes if we can get them. I'm afraid to add it all up and see how much it costs. Whether your home is filled with toys or technology, you're probably used to battery burnout. Oh. It seems to me like every other time I go to the store, I'm buying some more batteries. Cliff buys the least expensive ones, but is cheap always best? To find out, we tested the top selling AA batteries. For three weeks, we tested flashlights and magic monkeys. They move and make noise. We then compared our results with testing at Consumer Reports. We have a protocol that's designed to use these cameras in a way which mimics average use. In the three sets of tests, we found a battery that stands out from the rest. When I see one that says, hey, there is a huge difference, then I'll absolutely look at that. In our unscientific test, we chose five brands. Rayovac, Duracell Copper Top, Duracell Ultra, Energizer Max, and Energizer Advanced Lithium. Then we loaded the batteries into 25 flashlights. Three, two, one, go. We ran our test twice. Three, two, one. And averaged our results. Rayovac batteries were most consistent. In this test, the first Rayovac died at five hours and four minutes. Eight minutes later, three more were dead. The final one died 12 minutes after the first one. While Rayovac is consistent and less expensive, in our flashlight test, it took last place. In our toy monkey test, all the batteries perform better, some more than others. Railback jumped two spots, going from last place in our flashlight test to third in our toy monkey test. There's one battery, though, that never changed in ranking. The Energizer Advanced Lithium earned the top spot in all our tests. Look at this one. At five hours and 30 minutes, the lithium, or the C battery, is still going strong. It's clapping wildly while the monkeys to the right and the left are clapping slowly. They both die a few minutes later. But the Energizer Advanced Lithium kept going and going and going. It lasted almost three hours longer than any other battery. The Energizer Advanced Lithium also scored high in Consumer Reports tests. You just have to look past the price. You get a lot more use out of just one pair, even though they might cost a little more initially. The lithium batteries cost us $1.74 each, compared with less than a dollar for all the others we tested. While lithiums performed well in all our tests, Consumer Reports says be careful which one you buy. In Consumer Reports tests of cameras, Energizer Advanced took 809 photos. The Energizer Ultimate took just 470 photos. That's a big difference in power, but about the same price. While lithium is tops, Consumer Reports says don't use it in every product. Something that is used only infrequently and it takes only a small amount of current is where alkalines might be better. Remote controls, for example, your clock. Our testing found batteries perform differently in every device. For example, Consumer Reports named the Duracell Ultra Advanced the top alkaline battery in its digital camera test. But in our tests, the Duracell Ultra Advanced performed worse than the cheaper Duracell Copper Top. It all depends on what you're powering up and how much you want to spend. While we ran our toys continuously in our unscientific tests, the battery makers do their testing differently and say they have scientific data to back up any claim that they make on the packaging. For full statements, go to newsnet5.com and join the conversation with our Twitter hashtag, WEWS Battery, and let us know which battery is your favorite. On your side, Jen Strathman, News Channel 5.